Puzzle games can be difficult, but what's more difficult is trying to decide the top five puzzle games of all time. I've managed to choose five, but with so many great games out there, I've also included some honorable mentions. I'm gonna rip the bandaid off now and say that Portal 2 is not on this list because it's roughly on every list ever, including one we put out a couple of weeks ago, link in the description. And I wanted to highlight some other games. Here come the test results. You are a horrible person. But I've included it in the honorable mentions, so don't at me. At number five, we have Antichamber. Antichamber is a first person puzzle platformer game developed by fellow Australian Alexander Bruce in 2013. What stands out instantly is its unique art style, utilizing bright colors and no colors. What stands out later is the breadth of puzzles and the satisfaction you get from solving them. Antichamber gives you very little information to work with and encourages you to see things differently. A problem solver's delight. At number four, we have Myst. Myst is an adventure puzzle game developed by Cyan in 1993. If you're watching this video, you'll probably already know that your task in this game is to explore an island, solve puzzles, and uncover the mysteries of the island's previous inhabitants. Myst laid the groundwork for a generation of puzzle games and was once the best-selling PC game of all time. It just got a 2021 remake, so if you haven't played it yet, now's the time. Hey, just a reminder to like the video if you like it, and if you don't, you can block us on Twitter at Gamify. Back to it. At number three, we have Return of the Obra Dinn. Obra Dinn is a mystery puzzle game developed by Lucas Pope in 2019. It's essentially one large logic puzzle where you play as an insurance inspector investigating the Obra Dinn, a ship that's been missing for five years that has reappeared with no survivors. Your task is to reconstruct the events of the voyage and determine the fate of all 60 members aboard. You carry a pocket watch, which allows you to investigate the moment of death of any corpse found. The beautiful one-bit art style draws you in and the mystery keeps you hooked. If you haven't already, I highly recommend you check it out. Free because you were made to be free. At number two, we have the Talos Principle. The Talos Principle is a narrative driven puzzle game developed by Crow Team in 2014. In this game, you're an unnamed humanoid robot guided through beautiful environments by a disembodied entity named Elohim. This is the kind of game you don't want to spoil with too much information, but I will say it's one of those games that will have you not only pondering puzzle solutions, but life itself. Much like the number one pick. But first, it's time for those honorable mentions. See, it's there. It's right there. I put it in. See, I told you. It's right there. See, it's there. See. And finally, at number one, we have the witness. The witness was developed by Jonathan Blow in 2016. You explore an island filled with grid puzzles and a wide range of environments. That may sound simple, but the more you learn about the island, the more you learn about the puzzles. The more you learn about the puzzles, the more you learn about the island. The island itself is beautiful and yet has logic at its core. I can't go into too much detail here without spoiling anything, but you'll constantly find yourself staring at a lake or a windmill and wondering if there's more to it, and there usually is. I can't remember the last time I spent as much time away from the game thinking about puzzles and working through theories as I did actually playing the game itself. If you love solving problems, interpretation and exploration, then I encourage you to avoid all spoilers, pick up a notepad and treat yourself with this puzzling masterpiece. That's all for now. Don't forget to hit that blue like button if you like the video and subscribe for weekly videos. I'd love to hear your favorite puzzle games in the comments. And as always, for more info about gamification, head to our website at gamify.com. See ya.